Welcome ladies and gentlemen. So what I'd like to do is show you how to um, determine the arc length when given the radius and theta. And the formula that we're going to use is S equals R times theta, where S represents the arc length, which we are trying to find. R represents uh, the radius, uh, which we are given in both problems. And uh, theta represents the angle in radians. Now, it's very important to remember that, that to use this formula, we got to have our angle in radians. So in this example here, you can see that we have R again, which is our 20 centimeters, and our theta, which is 3 pi over 4, is in radian format. So therefore, to determine the um, S, which would be our arc length, we're simply just going to plug in our radius times our theta. Okay. Now we're simply multiplying a whole number times a fraction. So I can simplify 20 over 4. I can reduce that to 5 over 1. Then I can just multiply across. So S is going to equal um, 15 pi, uh, 15 pi centimeters. Then obviously you could simplify that to a decimal, but um, you know I wouldn't want to leave that as approximation. So I will just keep it um, right there. Now when I have 120 degrees, you can see that that is in uh, degree format. So I, main important thing is I got to have that in radians. So to convert that over to radians, I am going to multiply that by pi over 180 degrees. Now remember when you multiply by pi over 180, simply all I'm simply going to do now is um, divide these two, and you can see that I can or reduce them. I can uh, reduce them by dividing out of 60, which is going to be 2 thirds. So this is 2 pi over 3. Now I have my angle in radians as well as my radius. So now I'll simply just do S equals R, which is 9 feet, times my angle in radians. Again, I can reduce this. I can do the 3 divides into the 9. 3 divides into the 9, 3 divides into the 9, 3 divides into the 9 three times, and then 3 times 2 is 6, so I have 6 pi feet. Um, again, I'm just going to leave that in that format. I am not going to multiply that all the way through, uh, but that is going to be your distance um, for your arc length. Thanks.